Hello everyone and welcome to episode 8 of my tutorial on Nemoria or Idiotic Ultimaris tutorial on Nemoria. This episode will be all about creating a dining hall and the difference between a dining hall and a great hall. Um, this is for later. Uh, I'll show you that when that is done. This here is going to be my great hall um, but first I'll show you how to create a dining hall. Uh, so, uh, and the and last episode we created, we sh I showed you how to create beds and bedrooms. So I'll see you all in a second once this has been mined out. See you all soon. Okay, I'm back for a little bit. Um, this is just a little couple of things while we wait for the dining hall downstairs to be done. Um, a good little tip when you are waiting for things to get done and you have spare gnomes, uh, especially your stone cutter and s carpenter. When uh, you have no nothing to do, always make sure your gnomes are working. And a good way to do this is go to your sawmill and have craft plank on repeat. This will mean they will craft planks either until they have nowhere to place them or they have no more resources to craft a plank with. The same with your stone cutters. It's really a useful technique because then you will always have blocks and planks, which are probably some of the most important um, resources in this game. Secondly, what we want to put in our uh, great hall is tables, chairs, and doors. We also want to put torches and statues in it as well. Uh, to make torches, you go into your carpenter's workshop. You can also make tables, doors, and chairs here as well. But I don't really like wooden tables and chairs, but they are still quite expensive. Anyway, just craft a couple of torches, and we will craft tables and chairs here. So let's just make two of each. Two two and two. I will be back once these are done and the hall, uh, the dining hall are done so I'll see you all. Okay so that's the mining done on our great hall or our dining hall to f start with. Anyway to create a dining hall you go and right click designate area and you go into dining room. Click on dining room, click on one corner drag it all the way to the other corner of the dining hall click and there is your dining hall made now we want to make a great hall the difference between a dining hall and a great hall there isn't much to be honest uh, a dining room and a great room a great hall are more or less the same just the difference between just the difference being a great hall are where idle gnomes and nomads tend to migrate towards also, the higher your worth or your shillings are for your great hall, the more like the more gnomes you'll get per nomad wave. Um, nomad waves are the first of every season, I think. I think that's about correct. Anyway, so we'll click this as a great hall. We don't have anything to put in it yet. But we will do, and I'll be back once we have stuff to put in at our great hall. So I'll see you in a sec. Okay, so we are done creating the tables, the chairs, and such. So you go into build, furniture, and table. Tables are, doors are literally just doors. You place them at an entrance, uh, and they can be attached to any wall. It doesn't matter if there's two walls. On either side, it just can be attached to a wall. Another one, the next one is furniture. We want a table and chair in here. So let's create a table. Now I want to create a grand um, dining hall. So let's try and make a grand dining hall. A different type of dining hall than normal. Um, I'll be back once I've created. Okay, so here we are. Um, here is our great dining hall. As I've said before, you can just build um, 
furniture and they will just be placed whenever they are available. We have a torch at either end uh, on the diagonals. I could put a torch on every single diagonal, uh, every single corner, and there are a lot of chairs and a lot of um, tables. Probably create a bigger dining hall eventually, but at the moment that will do us. Anyway, in this episode we have discussed how to create and improve your dining hall and how to create and improve your great hall and why it is useful to have a great hall. Anyway, uh, the next episode will be about creating a military. So, hope you've all enjoyed this. Please comment on the video and tell me how you think. I'll see you later. Have fun and goodbye.